Look how perfect this looks. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's go shopping for fall stuff. <laughs> Look how perfect this looks. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's go shopping for fall stuff. He looks so cute. Hi guys, so welcome. Okay, I know you see the title of this video. You know the vibes, you know what's happening today. So let me tell you. Today is September 19th when I'm filming this. Hopefully you're watching this on or after September 21st because if you don't know, September 21st is the first day of fall. Now, I know I'm probably one of the last YouTubers to decorate for fall, but let me tell you something. I know I always say this, but it's the truth. When you have a baby, time goes by so fast. It goes by so fast, girl. Like if you think time's going by fast right now, just wait till you see your baby's life. I don't know what, I don't know what's happening. Like, I don't know why time's going by so fast, but it's going scarily fast. Like I have an almost five month old. What the f like I just gave birth yesterday, girl. I just found out I was pregnant yesterday. How? How do I have almost a five month old? That's not the point of this video. The point of this video is I have a almost five month old. That's crazy. But anyway, um, time goes by too fast. So when I saw that everybody was decorating for fall in summer, I was like, mm -mm, not I. I am living in the moment, baby. I am living in the moment and I am not making time go by faster than it already is because I feel like stores do that. Like it'll be summer and they already have like Halloween stuff out. Like even the other day we went to uh, Costco and they literally had Christmas stuff, Christmas trees. I'm like, it's literally September. Everybody please slow down time. Like I feel like the stores make it go by faster than it already does. So in hopes to not make time go by faster than it already is for myself, I actually waited. I was a responsible adult and I am waiting until the beginning of fall to actually decorate for fall. So it's September 2019. September 21st is the first day of fall. By the way, it's actually Denny and I's anniversary, our boyfriend and girlfriend anniversary, not our wedding one. And and so we're gonna decorate for fall now, okay? Now, as you guys know, I have been on my decluttering mindset. I don't know if you've already seen my decluttering video. I don't know if it's coming out before this one or after, but I have been in my decluttering mindset, okay? So we're gonna be responsible decorators this year, okay? I don't want anything that sits on top of the counters, okay? I feel like I talked about this in the decluttering video. We'll say it again. The more stuff there's out, the more clutter there's in my mind. So right now, because I've been trying to get a lot of things out, I don't want to bring more things in, okay? Now, we're going to start off, I, we're going to go to Home Goods, we're going to go to Marshalls, we're going to go to TJ Maxx, we're going to go to Target, we're going to go to, what's the other store? Oh, Hobby Lobby. Hobby Lobby's a little bit of a drive, but we can go there. But I really want to do like a little bit of more responsible fall shopping. Honestly, you guys, I just, I don't want to bring too much stuff that we don't need, okay? So let's actually go to the garage and let's see what we already have. Welcome to our garage. Okay, I don't know why this trash just made it to here, but that's okay. We see some fall stuff over there. Where's my fall stuff? Did I get rid of all my fall things? I didn't, right? Okay, let's see what we have. I'm gonna put you right here. Wait, did I get rid of my fall stuff? Girl, because when I declutter, I literally get rid of things and I don't ask any questions. I just start. Okay, apparently I didn't have a look. Oh, I found it. So let's see what we have here. Oh, okay. We got lots of pumpkins. We got lots of pumpkins. We got some black and white pumpkins. But see what I mean? This is all stuff that goes on top of surfaces. And I don't want anything on top of surfaces, girl. So we got this. Um, over here, we have our fall wreath, esta, and we have my favorite fall cuadro, which just says grateful. Okay, this we could change right now, because right now we have the summer wreath out. Yeah, let's go put this out, and then I'm gonna kind of clean up the, the kitchen a little bit so that I can, como se dice, so that I can just have a clean slate.
go. Uh, I just finished cleaning. Well, just tidying up a little bit. So let me show you. Let me open up some windows so you can see. SJ and I are gonna be going to the store to get our decorations. Bye, puppy. Um, because Denny actually went to get our the merch for the QMRM shop. So I was like, okay, I could either stay home or we can go fall decor shopping. So I just kind of cleared out the space right here, the space right here a little bit, and then we have el comedor over here. So like I told you guys, we're not gonna be getting too many things to put on top of the counters because I feel like that looks kind of messy. But yeah, um, I'm gonna be driving by myself with SJ to the store and stuff. So we're not gonna be taking too much of a long trip because I feel like he maybe doesn't like the car seat for long periods of time. So I figure first we can go to Home Goods. Of course, I'm gonna get a fall drink. So let's go, girls. Okay, anything else I get for you? No, that'll be it. All right, we're gonna check the one. We are stopping at our mandatory Starbucks stop and we're getting a fall drink. SJ is actually behaving so well. Um, but yeah, so we are getting our fall drink. I always get the pumpkin chai with the foam. It is literally my favorite drink, you guys. I am obsessed with that drink, even though it hardly has any caffeine. Yeah, can I do apple pie? Yeah. Thank you so much. You too. <gasps> my favorite fall drink. Yeah, let's see. Our first stop is going to be Home Goods. And then Marshall's is kind of close to it. So, oh my God, it looks literally perfect. Perfect, perfect. Perfect, where that <laughs> Look how perfect this looks. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's go shopping for fall stuff. So remember the challenge here is to find things that we can decorate with that we don't have to put on the countertops because we don't want a lot of things on the countertops. We just want things that look, you know, fall vibes without causing too much clutter. Oh my goodness, look at this. As you could tell, somebody got tired of the stroller. Somebody got tired of the stroller. So uh, we're using this carrier now. Yeah, ahorita, we're just gonna go hop over to Bath and Body Works. I'm not really getting any candles because I haven't been using candles for like the last couple of years, but I would like to get some hand soaps that would give us a little bit of fall vibes. <sighs> But yeah, I didn't really find much at Home Goods because I feel like it's kind of hard to decorate if you don't want to put anything on top of like your countertops. But I did find some stuff that I feel like could be like cute for fall and just like overall. So yeah, let's go into Bath and Body a ver qué encontramos. Okay, so the girl just said that all the or the hand soaps are five for twenty-seven. So we're gonna get some fragrances. This one is not good. I do not recommend this one. The bottle is really pretty, but it does not smell that good. I'm not having too much success with the fall, um, but that's okay because I don't like to take too many seasonal ones because I feel like if you take all seasonal ones you don't go through it in the season and then you're stuck with all of them so we're just going to take some regular flavors as well Shop around while he sleeps. But so far, a very successful trip. 
I got him in the store sleep because I was covering him like this and then when I looked in he was like so <laughs> he only took a 30 minute nap which is okay I think um, he'll probably fall asleep on the car ride home but um, we're in here so I actually love coming to Hobby Lobby because they always have a bunch of different things um, but again the mission is they have a lot of things that you have to put like on countertops and stuff but I feel like I don't want that I don't want that. Mm -mm. So let's see what we find. Siempre tiene muchas cosas diferentes y así, like little knickknacks. So let's see what ends up coming out. Girl, look at the Christmas stuff. It's already out. Do you guys see it? This is what I mean when I tell you time goes by faster because literally all the Christmas stuff is already out. Like, Maria and Eileen put 11, please. Maria and Eileen put 11. I will tell you, I'm kind of shocked at the fact that all the Christmas stuff is out because literally they just have like a tiny little portion for fall and then everything else is Christmas. <laughs> so I do know that the Christmas stuff and the fall stuff, well actually the Christmas stuff, if you come in November, it's everything, everything's already sold out. So I'm probably going to come pick up our Christmas things soon and just film that video but not upload it for you guys until vlogmas um, because i'm like literally everything is christmas so we've only gotten a couple of things. um i'm gonna show them to you guys at the house but it's not gonna look super fall vibes but i'm trying i'm trying i'm trying so i'll show you guys when we get home but look literally everything's christmas 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 over there. Like the fall stuff is literally just one tiny little section. So, se va hacer lo que se va a poder. Okay, that was a fail. We walked over to Chase and I tried to use my Apple Pay there and they're like, it should work. But we tried like four different ATM machines and I was not able to get cash back with a pa. Call me, Anani. He's looking at me like, what are you talking about? Who are you talking to? A quien le hablas, mom? A quien le hablas, mom? So I wasn't able to get cash out. So everything that I got at Hobby Lobby, I'm not going to be able to take because I even went to a CVS and they were not giving cash back. So there's a Target right across the street. So I think we're going to go there to see what we find just like as one last hurrah. What are you laughing at? Come to vomit on it. Just like as one last try. Um, but I'm sad because I found some cute stuff at Hobby Lobby. But I know Walmart doesn't take Apple Pay. And now I know Hobby Lobby doesn't take Apple Pay. So just in case you guys are going to come shop, you definitely need to bring your card. And honestly, I just walk out with my phone now. Like, I never carry a wallet. I never carry a card, an ID, nothing, girl. I just, I'm out here. I'm out here just Apple Paying everything. Hello, you guys. We're at Target. Okay, as you guys can tell, obviously, I don't have my baby. Um, and the reason for that is because it's because we actually got home and he was not like in the car seat so I told Danielle I was like you know what lo voy a dejar contigo really quick and lo que voy a target and I get whatever I need because I feel like he was he had already been out all day and stuff so I was like oh I don't want to like have him out here if he doesn't want to be out here you know so we went home we dropped him off with his dad and now we're here shopping we came to target I'm kind of sad that it didn't work out with Hobby Lobby because I had already picked really cute things but it's okay no pasana. Some other time we can always go back to Hobby Lobby. But for now we're at Target and the fall vibes are falling. So let me show you. Do I need that couch? <laughs> I think I do. percent off right now <sighs> should i do it oh my gosh i don't know i really love the casa luna brand from target because it really does feel different than like regular sheets and stuff it is a little bit pricier but i feel like it's 20 percent off you know now do i want it in this color like beige or do i want it in this color if they had a green, I would take green. Oh, we're gonna do this one. Can you wash machine these? Or los lavas a mano? Machine wash, tumble dry. Perfect. We're taking it. Right. So since we're here, we're actually gonna be taking a trip uh, sometime soon. And we actually need to take some frozen breast milk. So we're gonna get. Am I blurry? Why am I blurry? Um, we're gonna take a little lunch bag for SJ's breast milk. But it's like 
This one's cute, especially because, you know, green. This one is also cute, but I feel like it's a little bit big. I feel like this one is just the right size, especially because it's deep. And then, I think we're gonna take this one, the green one. Okay, we're almost done, especially because Jenny told me, he's like, I have to leave by six. He goes to play volleyball once a week, and so I love to respect his time, because obviously he does a lot for me. Um, so we have to be home ASAP. Ya van a ser las seis. We're back home, baby. We're back home, and I'm gonna show you everything we got from everywhere, okay? But look, this is the damage we did. It actually doesn't look like that much because it's not that much. Remember, we didn't go overboard with anything. Actually, if I would have gone, if I would have been able to go to Hobby Lobby and gotten my things, it probably would be more, but it's okay. Se hace lo que se puede con lo que se tiene. I'm just trying to give you guys some light right here. But, okay, let me do the haul now that we're here. Um, should I go by store? I guess I can go by store, and then I'll tell you my thoughts and opinions. Okay, here we are. Well, starting off strong. Hello, camera. Starting off strong with home goods. We got this leather pleather, like not a bag, but it kind of looks like a purse, huh? No, it's not a purse. It's for you to put like cojines or blankets in here. Uh, we had like a metal one, but I figured this would look very like chic, very fall vibes. But also when fall is over, we can keep this in the living room and it's still gonna look really, really nice. So I love this one. Um, this one was from Home Goods, And then I actually ended up getting us a new wreath because the one that we had, the one I showed you guys earlier, it was looking a little like it needed some TLC girl. So that one's gonna retire. We're gonna have this one. Uh, this one is from Martha Stewart Home. And yeah, I love it. I absolutely love it. Look, it looks really, really cute. And I feel like it looks fluffier and just more full as opposed to the other one. The other one looked like it had three, three leaves like fighting for their life. So this one's here. And then... I actually ended up finding this cojín and it's not a cojín for the, ¿cómo se llama? It's not for the couch. No, this one, you put it on the floor itself so you can actually sit on the floor. Now, you might be wondering, Stacey, why do you want to sit on the floor? Good thing you asked, let me tell you. Um, so I actually watched a documentary on Netflix called The Blue Zones where they talk about how the people in these blue zones in the world, they're living up to be like over 100 years old because they're basically maintaining like a really healthy lifestyle. And in one of the blue zones, I don't remember which one, people sit on the floor all the time. And so because they're sitting on the floor, they're basically doing a squat every time they get up. And because they continue to do squats throughout their whole life by getting up from the floor, they're able to get up and down when they're older like when they're elders right and i don't know if you guys have like older people in your life but when i used to be a personal trainer literally one of the main goals for older clients used to be to just be able to move so i don't ever want to lose my ability to move so i am going to make an effort to start sitting on the floor more often so that's why I got this one and it was on clearance. Normally it would have been $70, it was 50, which is still a lot. But this one's also gonna st stay out year round, okay? So we got this one, super cute. I'm gonna show you guys everything right now when we put it out. I just kinda show you, wanna show you what everything is. Next up, we got my friend, Bath and Body. Super cute. Okay, now another thing I know, I'm turning into like, whatever, you'll judge for yourself. But anyway, um, I kind of stopped getting candles from Bath & Body or candles overall everywhere. Uh, the reason being is because supuestamente, I don't know if this is true, I don't know if this is true or not, but supposedly candles mess with like your hormones. I don't even know if I'm saying this right. Like you guys let me know what you think. But supposedly when you burn candles in your house, this was like a rabbit hole I went down on TikTok. Supposedly when you burn candles in your house, you release toxins that mess with your hormones. And then that's why you like could get acne and like your hormones can be imbalanced. So I was like, okay, ¿quién me manda? I don't need to be burning candles in my house. It's fine, right? So I'm not going like 100% getting rid of scented things 100% because I still like for things to smell really good. But I was like, well, if I can avoid it a little bit by not having candles burning, then I won't. So that's why you haven't seen buy candles in a while. But one thing I do buy are these, the hand um, soaps, okay? So I tried a couple of different flavors as you guys saw at the store. 
I don't know why I wasn't having like, I wasn't finding the good stuff, right? So this is the only fall scent that I ended up liking. The rest, I was like, oh no, not the vibe. Este sí huele bien rico, eh? Se llama Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin. This one I do think you would like if you go to Bath and Body. And it was five for $27, so I got some extra ones. I got this one, Eucalyptus and Spearmint. This one is sea and sandstone. And then I got another sea and sandstone. And this one is crisp morning air. I'm pretty sure you could tell, but I like a little bit more of like clean scents, like more minty, fresher. So that's kind of like my vibe. Um, I ended up getting a little thing for to put in my car. How cute is this? Look, it has a snail with like a mushroom that has like little crystals in it. And I got the scent leaves. This is the scent that I got. So I also ended up getting um, winter candy apple, which smells really good. And then remember I said I didn't want to put anything on the counters. Well, there's these soap holders um, from Bath and & Body. And these are really, really cute. And I was like, okay, well, we already have the soaps on the counters, so I can easily just make them fall. And then you don't have anything extra on your counters. Look, so I figured this was super cute and it's not like, it has a purpose. It's not just there for decoration. So I got two, I got one for the bathroom and one for the kitchen because those are the two places where we wash our hands. But yeah, these are super cute. So that was Bath & Body. As you guys know, we did go to um, Hobby Lobby. <laughs> it makes me so sad that they don't accept that movie. So I walked the whole store. I got a bunch of things. And then literally as I was walking up, I was like, you accept Apple Pay? She was like, no. And I was like, ugh, my heart. And she's like, there's a Chase Bank across the street. And I was like, okay, let me go. So I go at Chase Bank. I don't know why I'm at. It just wasn't meant to be. It wasn't meant to be. Because if it would have been meant to be, it would have been easy and it wasn't. So it's fine. We can go to Hobby Lobby some other time. Maybe for Christmas shopping, because like I told you guys, all the Christmas stuff is already out. Literally all the Christmas stuff is already out. So I'm thinking I'm gonna get our Christmas stuff sooner than later because I want to, um, yeah, like I just wanna make sure I have everything that I want, you know? If you go to Hobby Lobby like November, December, you get like whatever's left. I don't want whatever's left. I want, I want to pick from the things that are there, okay? But Target does take Apple Pay, so we did end up going to Target. So let me show you what we got at Target. Okay, first things first, this is not fall related, but it is, it is a necessity. We're gonna get up close and personal and let me tell you something. Um, when you're using the restroom, when you're going number two, it's good for you to have your feet elevated, okay? Because when your feet are elevated like this, um, basically your, your system is working with you, right? Gravity is working with you. When you're just sitting at a 90 degree angle, you're not hitting optimal position for going number two. If you put your knees up to your chest by having them on a stool, basically you can P-O-O-P better, okay? So I finally got a squatty potty. That's the name of this. You could just get a regular stool. You don't need one of these, but this one does go into the toilet. Like it sits into the toilet like this rather than sitting out of the toilet. So I'll let you guys know if we like it. Um, so yeah, this is one of the things that I got. I ended up getting some decorative pumpkins for our porch. These are plastic ones. I was gonna get the Halloween ones, the ones with the faces on them, but I didn't wanna do that because I was like, okay, as soon as Halloween is over, they're gonna be outdated and I don't want that. So I want these to last from October to November until we go like all out for Christmas. So I got four of these, but I left two of them in the car because um, you know, you know, I couldn't carry everything. I got this mat for under our mat. So it looks like this, like this. And then the rest of the stuff you already know, I got the cooler for SJ and then I got him a little newbie because he loves this toy, you guys. If your baby is like of, you know, teething age where he likes to put things in his mouth, like his hands, get them one of these. SJ absolutely loves his and we have, we usually leave it in the car seat, so now I got him one to have here in the house. So this is a 10 out of 10. We literally have two of them. So I'm gonna, oh, actually, let me show you the blanket that I have been wanting forever. 
we're gonna see how big it is and i'm so excited because it's breathable and it looks nice and fancy da -da 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 -da. oh my gosh it's beautiful and it's heavy wow i love it oh my goodness it's beautiful and it was on sale Okay, so that was basically it for our little fall haul. I'm gonna put everything out right now. Denny's gonna go play, so I'm probably not gonna do it right now, but I'll show you guys in the next clip um, so you can see the way everything came out. Mm -hmm.